From the Crime Beat, police continuing their search tonight for two suspects who they say shot and killed a young man on Claridge Road this morning. Jiminy Swain was on the scene as authorities conducted their initial investigation. Police are not describing it as a trend, but another man on bail who was electronically monitored was killed in the capital Saturday morning. Investigators blocked off a portion of Claridge Road to gather evidence around the body of the male victim, who police suspect is no more than 18 years old. Officer in charge of the Central Detective Unit, Chief Superintendent Solomon Cash, said police received reports of gunshots on Raymond Road just after 9.20. Officers responded to the scene. Uh, when they arrived, they met the uh, lifeless body of a male who were lying alongside the street. Um, EMS was summoned, uh, who examined the body and pronounced uh, the body uh, deceased. Um, the only information we're working with thus far is that uh, shortly um, before uh, 9.20, uh, a silver color uh, vehicle drove through the corner. Um, two occupants emerged from the vehicle, all wearing uh, hooded uh, jackets. Um, they produced weapons and they discharged at the victim. Chief Superintendent Cash said the victim was hit multiple times. Authorities believe that the victim had just made a purchase at a local store when he was accosted by the suspects. Several curious onlookers assembled at the scene to watch police conduct their initial investigation, while several individuals believed to be family members were overcome with grief. The CDU chief confirmed that the unidentified man was known to police. Another victim who's been electronically monitored, uh, he's currently out on bail uh, for an offense uh, and uh, we monitor these uh, individuals as we know uh, they're out here in the public uh, but again we would, we would want to advise uh, persons who are privileged to be out on bail uh, you know, to be careful and cautious of the, the movement in, in, in society. Chief Superintendent Cash maintains they will continue to monitor these homicides. I wouldn't um, refer this as a trend, but I would advise those persons who are electronically monitored to be careful uh, how they move about in society. And I can tell you, um, we, we are persons who, who organize themselves in small pockets of uh, criminal groups who target each other. Again, police are making an appeal to anyone who may have been in this area that may have seen something to contact them at 919-911 or at Crime Stoppers, which is 328-TIPS. Jimenita Swain, ZNS Network News.